Okay, so I'm gonna do something new here and I'm not gonna read the intros anymore because I feel like they take me just a little bit out of flow and realistically, like you guys have been reading uh, all the dialogue anyway, if you've been watching, so uh, <laughs> if you already do <laughs> if uh, you didn't like it anyway, like uh, then there's no sense in like uh, kind of clickbaiting you and reading all this stuff and then I, I kind of skip over all the dialogue. So I might as well get you used to it from the jump anyway, right? Let me just save you some time to see if you actually like this or not. So <laughs> just like how uh, Hector Mode uh, kind of saves us some time, actually. I really like this, how they don't just recap like, uh, you know, they don't do like, oh, hey, this is the continent and here's all the, the places on the continent like uh, Ellie Wood Mode does, right? Like it's actually from Hector's pers perspective and this line right here, right? The path he chooses will test him to the limits of his strength. Like that just has perfect prequel energy right there right like that's that's how you do a prequel you know like that's how you get it get me invested in your prequel by like being like okay yeah that's right like how does hector become the man that he becomes in binding blade right i mean too bad the story is dog shit but uh <laughs> like that's that's besides the point you know like uh i will praise the moments like that that come along in here because like fv7 has a lot of really good moments in this it has just about the the right sense of like uh the right balance of humor, uh, tragedy, victory, and all that stuff, like, uplifting. It, it has moments, for sure, like, but it's just, like, the the story, like, not only is it a terrible prequel, because it doesn't really connect uh, that well with the main story, or with uh, Binding Blade, I should say, but also because uh, they, they kind of just, uh, you know, they, they just kind of threw this plot together just like that, like, ah, whatever, you know, they had a cool premise, but they just uh, threw it in the toilet, so, I don't know. <laughs> Like, it would have been cool, like, uh, if somehow, like, them fighting Nurgle would have allowed the events of, uh, to directly, more directly tie to, like, uh, the events of, of Burn, right? Like, uh, literally something like, oh, hey, because Nurgle unleashed, uh, uh, dragons into the world, and they, he unleashed a little bit of magic, right? Uh, Yon in the dragon sanctuary recovered just enough to, like, uh, uh, be able to, you know, uh, power him up, essentially, so that way... You can get uh, FE FE seven started, right? So, or FE six started, I should say. <laughs> it's just uh, you know, just one of those little things like that. It's like, hey, like the the events of this game should directly tie in with your sequel, right? Just like look at how Better Call Saul is doing it, just phenomenal, man. Like they could literally choose to end it like right as Walt walks into Saul's desk, and it would just be like, wow, what a great like uh, what a great show. He <laughs> just really. Really phenomenal storytelling and just it. Oh my god, that's why I love prequels, man. Like, cause I'm not gonna lie, like I, I really enjoy the, the moments so much, cause I'm, I'm obviously like I keep dick writing them, right? But uh, no, I, I really do enjoy good moments, and uh, like FE7 is filled with them. It's just that, like, um, from a story perspective, like uh, it just, uh, it's just trash. But uh, yeah, like uh, that's the, uh, that's just my little thing on, on the story, right? <laughs> but it's okay. Like uh, this, despite that, like the, the gameplay is top tier i would say like uh, especially doing this rank run like uh my god i'm actually gonna push myself to my absolute limits at this point because <laughs> uh, i've never done like a, a real like hector hard mode rank run i think i started it but then like uh uh because uh it's not properly programmed and i saw like oh hey i'm doing extra chapters and like uh well this is bad for my rank run like i'm my my turn <laughs> my turn uh uh, what's it called? My turn ranking was going down the, the drain, too, like, because obviously all these uh, zero requirement chapters that were never properly implemented, like, they obviously hurt my rank and, like, uh, you know, but I figured, you know what, I'll try. I'll try my best. Like, uh, I'll really, like, uh, do exactly what I need to do and uh, just kind of, like, go with it, right? So uh, this is kind of going to suck because, like, uh, <laughs> now I'm, like, thinking... Uh, like i'm already starting with a deficit essentially like uh this sucks because like this is unfortunately all the hector uh mode exclusive chapters are uh zero turn requirements because they were never properly programmed so that means every so that means essentially like this chapter like i'm, I'm gonna like uh i'm gonna essentially go over the zero turn requirement by eight eight turns because like that's as fast as i can beat the game <laughs> this one while getting everything right and keeping kind of everybody safe unless like I, I RNG abuse, but I'm not going to do that. So, uh, and in fact, like, I think I might even do it like where if, uh, if I fail or if I lose somebody, I might even like just, uh, uh, I might restart all the way. So that way you guys can see like, uh, you know, that there's no like RNG shenanigans going on and stuff. So, 
Like, oh, speaking of which, I, I gotta see if this guy has, like, uh, 15 defense or 14 defense. Because if he has 15, I have to reroll. Okay, good. Okay, so he did have 14 defense, but uh, I gotta restart anyway because I, I kind of messed up. But, uh, you know, very unlucky on a hand axe miss. And, like, uh, unfortunately, because this chapter is... Uh, uh, you know, it's a zero turn requirement chapter. I gotta play perfectly, especially since it's the first level. So, like, uh, I can't afford all these misses. And, like, uh, yeah, it's just really unfortunate that, like, they, they never properly uh, coded this. But, uh, it's okay. It, it happens. It is what it is. Uh, mm, okay, so. Ideally, I attack him. And then, uh, Hector. Okay, so he should get out of the way. Hector should just go straight and, like, uh,. Murder this guy, I think, uh... Yeah, yeah, because he can block the passageway while I open the door. Oh, no, of course not. <laughs> okay, that's, uh, kind of cringe, I'm not gonna lie. Like, uh, but... If, uh... If Hector draws all the other guys this way, then it, it shouldn't be that bad, okay? Like, as long as Hector doesn't miss here. Like, this would just be an unfortunate miss. <laughs> and that also sucks, too, because I just realized, like, I'm gonna be doing multiple takes as well, so it's like, uh... Uh, God, like, uh... Hopefully, like, uh, I don't lose people. Like, I think that's really, like, the only way I would uh, do it is if I lost people. Like, or if I lost people too fast and, like, uh, I was just sucking. Like, uh, yeah. Like, I would just uh, probably restart, but uh, it's okay. Like, uh, so, um, okay. Hector has... Hector has what he needs, right? And, uh... Just tell me they're in range. Oh, of course not. <laughs> that sucks. And, of course, oh, they're gonna block off the doorway. Yep, I, I love it. I love that they're gonna do that. And of course, uh, yep. Ah, uh, this is this sucks. This really sucks. Stupid, uh, stupid boss. <laughs> like, oh uh, no. Uh, oh my God, Hector doesn't even kill here. Like, oh my God, this is trash. This is so trash. Like, I think what I should have done was, uh, I should have just took the hit and uh, I would have grabbed the chest. Would have came over. I uh, it wouldn't have mattered. Like, ah. Uh, uh, it sucks. I I hate this chapter. <laughs> like, not because it's bad, but because like you had to play perfectly since uh, you know you need to save as many turns as possible right off the jump too. Like it's just very like uh, very brutal. Like uh, if there was one chapter that did not need to be like uh, untested, it should have been this one. Like or unprogrammed, I should say. Oh god. Uh, like I I at least wish that like Hector uh, two uh, two rounded these guys. Or one rounded, I should say, because, uh, or two shot, just two shot. Yeah, there you go. That, that sounds cleaner. Like, I wish he would have been able to do that because, well, uh, now I'm wasting even more hand axes and, like, they're not going to die. And, like, uh, I got to be careful, too, like, that I don't get killed by the boss. Uh, uh, I might save a turn, actually, doing that. But, uh, you know what? Let me steal this guy's red gem. Like, if I do that, he should be, like, he should be gone. So, like, uh, or he should attack me. And then I can steal his red gem. So, uh, whatever. It looks like I'm gonna finish up in like the the amount of turns that I, I was going to anyway. Like uh, I was trying to save myself one turn, but like the only way I can do that now uh, is if I somehow dodge all these guys' attacks. And like I'm not gonna dodge that. Like uh, maybe if I dodge the boss like twice, like the, the, the that'd be the only way. But like uh, yeah, I figured. Okay, so I'm pretty much in KO range right now. So. Damn, that sucks. That really, really sucks. <laughs> but at least Matthew will get a kill, so... Oh, God. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, he'll get a kill, and then, like, uh... That's just more XP. Whatever. So, that sucks. I, I really wanted to finish this in seven turns. Like, I, I know it's... I keep saying this sucks, but it, it really does. Uh, oh, God. Hopefully, like, uh... Hopefully Hector dodges. And ho or no, hopefully uh, Hector doesn't get hit first. I should say or actually, no, what am I talking about? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Like, <laughs> I, <coughs> man. And I, I think it's pretty cool that, like, both Matthew and uh, Hector have dialogue with this boss. Uh, it's just one or the other. So, like, uh, I don't know. I just like uh, little things like that. Like, I wish uh, more, uh, there was more dialogue between characters. Like, uh, and especially, like, during these little fights. I, I like secret little interactions like that, right? Like, you would think, like, uh, when two people are fighting, like, uh, how much they hate each other, right? And, uh, okay. If I had known I would have, uh, dodged that, like, I would have attacked, so. Actually, I think that would have been worth the risk anyway to, like, RNG abuse for that shit, but, uh, whatever. Uh, at least Matthew gets more XP. Like, that's good. Uh, okay, so, uh, did I steal everything? I'm pretty sure I did. 
Or, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did. I did. So I can just kill him, and hopefully, like, hopefully Matthew hits here. Hopefully both of these guys hit here, because if not, like, this is just going to make the run uh, that much uh, harder. Like, uh... I'm over here trying to save turns and like, uh, but I ended up uh, fumbling the bag at the end anyway. So whatever, it's 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 fine. Uh, and wow, oh my God, Matthew is pretty high level, like uh, level seven thief. Like I did not think he was that high. Like, <laughs> but it makes hey, like his bulk is good here. So, and I technically have a shot to live here as well. Like I could have dodged the bo uh, the boss's next attack. So, whatever, eight turns is not bad. Like that's usually about like uh, I think the. The fastest uh, you can get it, like, uh, if you play, like, a certain strategy. But, like, uh, you know, like, I'm sure I could have got it with six turns, like, if I knew what I was doing. But, like, uh, you know, like, hey, like, <laughs> I don't want to, like, uh, I don't want to, like, really look up into, like, uh, too many guides, right? Like, I just want to play as best as I can, right? Like, uh, I don't really want to look for help. I'm just going to, like, you know, do my thing. Like, show you guys my Fire Emblem knowledge off the top. And, like, uh, actually, that's not true. What am I talking about? I'm probably going to look at a couple of guys to be like, all right, like, what ideally, what's my range uh, around here? So, uh, so that way I can see if I can come under it as well as, uh, you know, like, uh, boost my other ones, too. Like, so, you know, anywhere where I can save turns. Like, so that's pretty much, like, my whole thing. Like, not only am I going to prioritize, like, saving turns, like, uh, I'm going to need a lot of XP as well, so. And then, of course, you know, I got to get the treasures as well and all that. Like, damn, <laughs> this is really hard. Like, so I don't know if I'll do the, if I'll be able to get all, all five stars, especially with, like, six additional chapters, like, that are not properly programmed. But I, I'll try. Uh, I'll definitely try. So I think that that's a, uh, that's pretty cool. I like the challenge of it, you know. As long as, like, uh, I can cut my turns, like, uh, significantly, like, uh, I think I can do it. But, like, uh, yeah, because, like, I don't think I've seen anybody, like, do, like, the entirety of, like, uh, Hector hard mode and, like, uh, get an S rank. Because, unfortunately, they're not, uh, the chapters are not properly programmed, so. But, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Like, uh, give me a like if you enjoy what I do. And, uh, yeah, let me know if you, you enjoyed me just getting into the game, like, straight from the, from the jump. So, uh, take care.